Hey guys, it's Joanna, and I'm spending a lot of time in the barn right now, so I thought I should just use this time to vlog, because I've never actually done a type of barn vlog, and uh, yeah, it's just in the exact moment I started vlogging. It started to rain! Yay! Yeah, so I've been at the barn since 9, I think. Now it's 10.20. Um, yeah, I don't know. Today, my parents just dropped me off early in the morning, and then they're going to pick me up at like noon or something. And I just used the time to kind of sort out everything in the barn, because it tends to get very messy. Because I actually still don't have a tack trunk, or a tack locker, because in Germany, we usually don't have tack trunks, but like lockers. And after six months of owning a horse, I still don't have one, which is absolutely great. No, so I managed to replenish his stock or supply of carrots. There, there, there. That's my beautiful tack corner. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I just filled up all his carrots and I don't know. I had to, oh yeah, because being the amazing horse that he is, he managed to poop exactly into his um, food tray thing, whatever it's called, I don't know. Okay. I don't know what I would actually call it, because it's not a bucket, but I guess it's kind of a bucket. Well, he managed to completely make that disgusting, so I had to wash out all that, and by doing that, I actually found out that it's super easy to clean, because all you can do is take out that center piece right there. See? So now that's all clean and nice and so yeah, after cleaning that, I don't know, oh yeah, I can just show you. So this is his beautiful stall. He's got his little toy hay thing there. So in case he gets bored, like usually it's filled up with hay right now. He just ate all of it. And then like there, he's got his little, you know, water thing, automatic water dispenser. He's got a window, and he's got this little hole, because this barn used to be an old cow thing, so they've all got these little hole things. But you know, it's like a lot of fresh air, and I, don't know, I guess you can stick his nose through if it feels like it. And then, yeah, that's the stall. And in this part of the barn, like in the aisle, like the building that I'm in, we're actually just four horses. So, we've got, we've got his best friend Comet in this stall. They're all empty now. We've got Rivaldi in here and Legiari in that last one. And yeah, they all seem to like each other, which is good. And yeah, I just turned out all the horses. So, they're usually on their um, paddocks over here. So, we've got these. But now, because it's starting to be summer, we put them all the way. That's it. Come on, camera. You can do it. You can focus. Hello. Look at camera not wanting to focus. Hello. There are the horsies. So, it actually stopped raining now, which is good. I guess it was just like a two minute kind of thing. But yeah. There are the horses, all munching on their grass. But yeah, the plan... Wait, I hope I'm focused, because I just noticed like a lot of it was not in focus. There. Um, yeah, the plan for today is just doing some pole work with uh, Klaus again. And I don't know, I think he had a kind of chill day yesterday. I have my lesson on Friday, so it's Sunday right now. Um, so yeah, he should be good. It's still new to him to do like any kind of pool work, especially outside. So it's very stressful for him. So he's being a really good boy. But I'm just gonna let him like eat another hour because you know that's what horses do. They eat. There, that's his buddy. That's Hawaii. That's Klaus. They love each other. They're both like the 
um, babies of our little mini herd. So they're both six. And yeah, they're very cute. Hi, big guy. Hello. Hello. Hi, hi, hi. No, you can't eat me. I'm not edible. Can we get another shot together, Klaus? Yeah. Can we do that? Can we do that? <laughs> but yeah. No. The horses, luckily, all got. Ooh, no. The horses all get along very well, which is very nice because then that way they can all chill together. And there. That's the grandpa of the group. He's, I think, like 17 or something. And he's 16. But yeah, um, I don't know, what else to say? We get like, I can do like a little mini barn tour. So yeah, I was thinking, oh yeah, um, we reached 5,000 subscribers like last week or something, which is awesome, so cool. And I was thinking about doing like a barn tour because I think when we reached 1,000 subscribers, we did a barn tour, like Jamie's barn. And I don't know now that I've known this, I guess I could maybe do it at 5,000. Tell me in the comments if you guys would like to see a barn tour. Hi, big guy. Hello. But yeah, I can do like a little mini barn tour. So, field, horses, another field, fence, llamas. And oh my god, what is wrong with my camera today? So it just doesn't want to focus. There, llamas. Got a little full in the background there. More llamas. More llamas. Oh, some horses. And... Nope, you can't see right now. There, we've got donkeys and goats. Because, you know, that's the kind of barn we are. We've got, you know, we take every type of animal that needs shelter. <laughs> I don't know. No, the owner of the barn just has like a llama farm or something somewhere. So we have got, so we've got all those. And the donkeys and goats? I don't even know where they're here. They're just here. They like to chill. Yeah. So, right now I'm just chilling with the horses on the field. And I've got the wrong camera lens on right now to vlog. So I'm just gonna chill like this. Hi, big guy. Hello. You can barely see anything right now. There's his face. There's my legs, there's his body, he's always on top of me. Oh look, more horses to come watch. No, I was just taking some pictures because these two, oh, they gotta go at it again. We're just so adorably cute and massaging each other. Are you getting jealous? I'm sorry. Here, you can get more camera time. Oh yeah, that's why I've got the wrong lens on. So, I'm way too close. There. The thing is, he'll just not leave me alone. He'll just follow me wherever I go. But I mean, it's very cute of him, of course. And there are the two lovebirds. <laughs> so cute. Yeah, the weather is so icky today. It's really cold and I kind of just want to ride now. But I can't because he's supposed to eat. And uh, I'm so cold. You won't even understand a bit. Mm. No, right. I'm cold. Hurry up, big guy. Donkeys. Now you can see them. Aren't they adorable? Goats? I don't know. The goats always disappear because they can just walk under the fence and go where they please. Look at these artsy shots, which don't really work because I've got the zoom lens on. So I just brought him in from this field and now we're gonna ride. Ain't that right, buddy? I know. Oh. He looks so modern, doesn't he? No, so I'm actually gonna ride inside today in the indoor because, like I said, I probably mentioned it way too many times now, but the weather is absolutely disgusting. Yes, so let's get you all cleaned up and tacked up and ready to go, right? Yeah, let's do that. I think it's a good idea.
We're now headed to the barn. Uh, barn, I'm saying. To the indoor. And let's see. I think he's gonna be a good boy today. It was really good. We didn't do a lot of pool work, but we did instead of we worked on transitions, we dropped piano transitions because once he enters, he doesn't stop anymore. Or he just like I think with a really fast trot. But he did that really well today. So I'm very proud of him. Okay? I'm proud of you. So yeah, he just got his food, his lunch, which is just a handful of pellets. I don't know, yeah, two handfuls, something like that, which is right, a half, a quarter or something, so he gets a half. And yeah, now I'm just gonna clean up all his tack, and then he's gonna get a little bath, or at least wash off his legs. Hello, Dickie. Hello. Hi. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. It's normal. Come on. Go eat your food. So the weather decided to go all sunny on us again. I mean, I'm not really complaining. I just wish I would have done that a little earlier while I was riding. So I could right outside, but oh well. I'm just on my way to get my crab. I forgot it in the indoor because he didn't eat it today. Actually, he, ne so, like, he never actually needs it. Just sometimes I use it to kind of stop him from going sideways, but I never actually needed to, you know, like encourage him to move because he does that very freely and usually too eagerly. But Today he was just really good, so I didn't use it at all. And I prefer not riding with a crop. Just too much things in your hand. 